Thank you, Murad. Kenzie is still marginal. I may be down, but I'm not out, and we're out there fighting. We'll get it back. And if we don't, they're not going to shut us up. None of us are going to be shut up by a minor, minor aberration like happened a few weeks ago. Um, and I can see many people out in the crowd who came out with us campaigning day and night. And thank you very much. Um, by chance, um, and thank you tomorrow. It's going to get. We had uh, a meeting of our uh, Iranian, we have a huge Iranian community um, in Kensington, and we had a meeting, thanks to Murad and Stop the War, just a few weeks before the election. Um, they had never got together in that way before, um, and it was, um, it was very moving, actually. The, a lot of people, some of them knew each other, some were family, but many of them had never met before, and we're going to continue to do that as Kensington Labour, aren't we, Sina? Thank you. Uh, um, and it was very moving, because the, the, just the concern written on their faces of what was going to come, and what may come, and they were all very, very afraid. Now, we have to remember, Kensington is not run by people like me. There are more people of all nations in Kensington than there are white British born. There's a, the minority is white British born and the majority in Kensington is everybody else. And we have a huge number of Iranians, Iraqis, all kinds of Middle Eastern people. And, you know, we are, I don't feel that we are educated enough. So number one on my list is for us to understand better all the things that all our communities are facing um, and to get that message out on the bus, in the tube, in the pubs, in our schools, universities and all our meeting places because a lot of people do not actually understand what their neighbours are going through and all the problems that they're going through. Um, and we need to, um, you know, I've been lobbied by 14-year-olds who are education on the um, on the national curriculum that's going to be a long battle <laughs> but um, you know the only weapon that we have or that I have right now the only weapon we have against the wall of lies misrepresentation and people who don't care they're just out in my stick uh, probably making babies um, not bothered there yeah, I think it's true um, <laughs> the only uh, the only defense we have is our truth and our right anger and we must continue to put our message out we want angry peacemongers angry peacemongers and please infect all your neighbors and friends educate and speak out thank you